What are the signs your newborn is constipated? I cannot tell if my baby is constipated or not. As a new parent, the joy of seeing your newborn for the very first time is priceless. You'll then be looking forward to your child's milestones such as smiling, laughing and first few babbling of words. While we all want our newborns to be as healthy as they can be, there are some instances that we have to watch out for. A baby's way of communicating with their parents is by crying. It's either they're hungry, needs a nappy change, feels cold, or something might be wrong. One of the common reasons why a newborn baby is incessantly crying is because he or she might be constipated. Here is a short guide in helping you determine signs your newborn is constipated. How will you determine the signs your newborn is constipated? On a newborn's first few weeks, his or her routine would most likely be this, sleep, eat, poop, repeat. Usually an hour, or less, after feeding, expect a nappy change to take place. This is a good indication that your child can digest milk properly and is not having difficulties absorbing the nutrients. And a perfect indication that the bowel movement is doing great. On the other hand, if your newborn is constipated, you'll notice that his or her tummy is slightly hard to touch. Your child's poop schedule may not be on the schedule, if you're exclusively breastfeeding. One more thing to watch out for is your baby's stool consistency. The average consistency is seedy, liquid and a little bit of pasty. If you see hard stools, it's a common sign, and action should be taken immediately. If you're giving your baby formula, changing the formula is an ideal thing to do. It is possible that your baby cannot digest the milk he or she eats, and you need to switch to lactose-free brands. For breastfeeding moms, a change in your diet is most likely what you need to do to treat this. Remember, your baby eats what you take, so you have to be cautious with what you eat. Constipation, although normal in some babies, should not be overlooked. If you have noticed this, taking your little one to the pediatrician won't hurt. Remember, the guide above mentioned are just guide in helping you identify signs your newborn is constipated. You should still bring your little one to the doctor to be on the safe side.